So Kling AI has just dropped version 2.1. And guys, it's absolutely insane. Take a look at this for some examples of the incredible things that Kling can do. Over the recent weeks, the AI video generating scene has gotten so intense. Google has come out with its VEO3 and that has been dominating the headlines recently. And basically what a lot of people have been saying is that VEO3 is the most advanced video generating software currently on the market. But Kling AI had something to say about that. It fired back with its new version 2.1 update. And by the looks of it, it looks to be the best video generator out there right now. What makes it so incredible is that it's three times more accurate, it dramatically improved its character consistency, it has much better text rendering capabilities, and the best part is that it is 10 times cheaper than Google's VEO3. Plus, with its new photo to video generating software, it's guaranteed to be one of the best out there. And guys, we're going to be taking a look at it today. Because in today's video guys I'm gonna be putting it through the paces to see if it really does come out on top as the best video generator out there so guys without wasting any more time let's jump into Kling and let's see if it deserves the title as the best video generator so guys the first thing that you're gonna do is you're gonna head over to the Kling website and once you're on there you're gonna click on a video and you'll see guys that they give you three different options they give you the text to video image to video and the multi elements but since we want to use the Kling version 2.1 one, the brand new one we can actually only use that on image to video so if you click on any of the others they're not gonna allow you to do so guys so I'm just gonna test it off guys just to show you what we are working with so guys I got this image online it's just a picture of an eagle and now guys when you go to the bottom you're gonna see the prompt section so when we are over there you're gonna need to add in a prompt in order to say what you want the image to do so over there guys I am just going to add in a quick little prompt I'm just gonna say the eagle looks around that it spreads its wings and it takes off into the air now we're not going to put in any negative prompts we're going to leave it on professional and five seconds is okay for now and then we're just going to click on generate guys and then in up to two minutes guys we are going to get our image but you guys have the luxury of seeing it right now so this is the result that we got now guys the one thing that i absolutely love about this result firstly we have to say that it looks absolutely incredible and the nice part about it is you can see the detail carries through on the entire video so all i actually did was i gave it an image of this eagle it only had the face to work with but it actually gave the entire anatomy of the bird you can see the wings you can see the feathers you can actually see the feathers on the very tip of the bird as well along with adding in little details like the movement of the feathers the movement of the hair even the glare as it looks up and it's about to take off all of that looks absolutely cool guys and this is just a cool starter guys. I have a feeling we're going to be getting into some cooler things as the video goes on. So guys, we got the first one out the way so we know that it can work with close-ups of animals and it really did so well. But now let's test it out just a little bit more. So if you guys would have watched our recent video, then you would have seen this girl. She is Amy who is our AI influencer. So if you guys haven't checked that out, then definitely go and check it out after this video. But guys, we created this image in the last video which was a picture of Amy drinking a matcha tea. Now guys, I want to use this image specifically because I want to see what can Kling do with a static image of a girl that we actually created ourselves. So guys, we're going to put it over here in start. Then we're going to scroll down guys and we are going to give it a new prompt. So I'm going to put in something like she is going to take a sip of her matcha tea and then she's going to smile at the camera. Extremely simple, but I'm curious to see what it can do. And then we're just going to click on generate guys and there we go guys. It is completed. Now let's take a look now guys i will admit that this is insane i was already really happy when i saw the actual picture of amy but the fact that we can actually see so much more detail and the video somehow made it all look super realistic like you can see the glare in her eye you can see her hair the light shining through the tiny little bits of hair in the background and it really does look like she's actually taking a tiny little sip of her matcha tea and you can see if you look super closely the matcha tea is actually moving in the cup so it's not just something out of the ordinary it's actually moving and guys just take a look at this little detail that it even puts in when she picks up the cup notice how you can see the sticker under the cup which if you go to a lot of coffee shops you'll notice that they always have the sticker under the cup and here you can actually see it and then you can even see the little wrinkles in her shirt and 
Let's not forget about the smile at the end, guys. Since the image does not utilize any teeth, that means that Kling basically had to make up her smile all on its own. And guys, it perfectly fits her. This looks as if the image was a screenshot of this video. I am super impressed so far, guys. And now, guys, just to play around with the fantastical side of Kling, just to show you guys how extremely cool Kling was, I went and I just created this. This was just something off the top of my head. It's a samurai who has fire coming out of his hands as he's about to go into battle. And it's just a little cartoon scene guys, but it is really interesting to see how realistic the fire looks firstly, how it actually brings all of these elements together, and also this is a way that you can see how it looks when you are using the zoom out feature. So these are tiny features that you can either type into your prompt or you can actually add them in manually, and then it will add in just this little bit of you are in control of the movement in your own video. But as you can see guys, the samurai looks extremely ready to get into a fight and it looks so cool. The part I absolutely love the most is as soon as you see the flames, you see the light on his face. So this is a small feature, but it's something that just shows how elite this tool is because on a whole lot of other generators, you would not see this. You would not see the light reflecting on the actual stands of the trees. You would not see it reflecting on the, on the leaves, and most of the time you wouldn't actually even see it reflecting on this guy's face, but yet it's doing all of that. So guys, this is just another one that I tied out. I was mainly just looking for a lot of different out of the world features. And mainly I didn't want the astronaut to be moving at all. I wanted him to seem as though he's floating back to earth. And guys, it even has the world by his hands, which I must admit is such an incredible little detail guys, because you can see the world within the world. And that is just, absolutely cool guys i love what it does with all the details and kling is just blowing my mind right now and don't forget guys if you want to check out kling for yourself then it is the first link in the description below but i know guys i just have a few more tests that i have to give kling before we can say that it is the best video generator out there so guys this is something else that i just thought about and you know what this was something that i actually saw on one of our previous videos that another video generator was actually struggling with so this is a lady who is busy working out and guys as you can see by the still image in the first second of the video that is the image that i used it was a lady that her arms had just stayed down so guys as you can see this lady is busy with a workout but there's no movement in the actual image because it's a still image but guys once i added it to the video generator it did this and it's absolutely cool how you can see the muscles flexing you can see her face actually tensing and my favorite detail has to be her face right at the end because you can see the vein popping on her neck you can see it on her forehead and you can see that she is actually staining her muscles in order to pull this off and guys that is really an elite level of having an eye for detail like it's really pulling off some stuff that maybe even human eyes would miss and it's showing us that guys but when it comes to all video generators guys the one thing that it always struggles with is when you just happen to be using a picture of yourself because if you use an image of yourself you are the best person to actually judge whether that looks accurate or not so guys i want you guys to let me know if this looks accurate because i'll be using an image of myself let me know in the comments below guys so guys this is just a picture of me that was taken at a recent headshot session and guys as you can see, this is pretty cool. Basically, all I asked it, guys, was to make this guy do something random. And it ended up making him blow a kiss. Or should I say, making me blow a kiss. Because I must say, guys, this is extremely accurate down to the hand details. Because I wasn't expecting the hand to basically look almost exactly like my own hand down to the nails. And remember, it's making a lot of it up. It can only see... A certain portion of me in the image but yet I found a way to actually add in the t-shirt sleeve because it noticed that I was wearing a t-shirt polar neck and it found a way to add that in it added in the buttons it kept the color consistent along with the detail and also you can see the hand movement guys and also guys when you pay attention to the face none of that looks out of the ordinary and that is what is making cling 
really the top video generator right now. You don't notice tiny little mistakes. So guys, just in case you guys are playing around with Kling AI and you do notice that you're starting to run out of different prompts to use, then I have a quick and easy solution for you guys. All you have to do is just put in the image. I'm gonna change it over to this full body image of myself. I'm gonna click on Deep Seek and then it's actually going to analyze the picture and it's gonna give us a prompt for this picture. So guys, if we give it just a few seconds, then there we go guys, it basically came up with this. The young man in the black turtleneck and the brown blazer sits on a wooden chair. He winks playfully and then he blows a kiss towards the camera. And then guys, all you have to do is just go to the inspiration and presets and then you can actually add in any movement. So for this, I'm gonna say the camera follows the subject moving. Then guys, as, as before, we're not gonna add in any negative prompts. Then guys, we're just gonna click on generate and guys, our results are in. And now guys, it's time for us to take a look at what it did with that image from the prompt that it gave us. Guys, I believe that if you are watching up until this point, then you are definitely a massive fan of Kling AI right now. Because as you can see what it's doing, I literally added in the movement to my face. You can see the movement by my legs as well, which to me is extremely impressive. And guys, it's just amazing how it actually takes what's there and it makes up just enough to make it believable. That is truly incredible guys. And guys, I just know that a lot of you, like myself, is going to be using Kling AI going forward to create some incredible videos. Now guys, if you do want to pick up Kling AI for yourself, then there is a current deal that is going and it is about $8 per month guys. But guys, with that, you also do get over 600 credits. And with that guys, you can create any video that you want and it will cost you anywhere between 35 credits to 100 credits for the longer videos. But as you can see guys, the results speak for themselves and I guarantee you that you are going to love every minute of it, guys. Just like I know that you love every minute of this video, guys. And also, guys, I have a feeling that you're going to love every minute of this video that is popping up on the screen right now. And also, guys, don't forget to let us know what is your favorite video generator down in the comments below. Also, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And I will catch you next time right here on Xenomedia.